Hey y'all, Irix Guy here back again with another Final Cut Pro 10 version 10.1 tutorial. Now 10.1 has introduced some different, uh, well quite a bit of, of enhanced user interface elements and one of them is how the events and projects are managed. So what I'm going to do here and you can check out my previous video where I explained how to create a Final Cut Pro 10.1 library uh, but here's the library I created. Now what I need to do is import some media. Now obviously I could click import media, but I'm kind of a drag and drop person, so I'm going to uh, I'm going to drag this. This is a MOV file. I'm going to drag it into 1225, which is today. And now you can see that uh, that video clip in there. This is a video that I that I filmed on top of the. Rockefeller Center in Manhattan. So now that I've got this, this right here you could consider to be an event. Whereas in, in the previous versions of Final Cut Pro 10, events would be here and then your projects would be down here. Let me show you how to uh, how to work with the events and projects here. So now when you do new project, and I'm just going to call it Rockefeller Center Test, or I'll just call it Rock, Rockefeller Center. And I'm going to select this event, which is today's date, 12-25-13. So when I hit OK, you'll now see the project here. So I've got my event, my event clips, or clip in this case. Let's drag another clip in there just so you can kind of see. So here's Rockefeller Center tree. So now, just to kind of illustrate how this would work, so if I'm if I'm working on a project called Rockefeller Center, maybe I want to have the view from from up top, and then I also want to have the view from the uh, ice rink. So these two clips that I put in here, that I put in the project, in the past we would refer to those as events. So within this 2013-1225 event, I have two clips. I've got the view from the top of Rockefeller Center and the view from Rockefeller Center ice, ice rink. And then also encapsulated within this is the project. And Final Cut Pro 10 version 10.1 refers to this as a library. So we've got a library here called MacBook Air. You can check out my other video where I created this. And within that library I've only got one event so far which is today's date within which there's a project by the name Rockefeller Center. So the projects are housed within the events now. Quite cool, huh? Anyway, share this video with others. Check out my other uh, Final Cut Pro 10.1 tutorials. And y'all have a good day.